this video is not for everybody. But if you are a guy and you are, you want to know what it takes to actually be a man, and there are some certain things that you shouldn't do. If not, you look like a woman or you, you start acting feminine, then you can watch this video. But if you are a female or a boy girl, please kindly leave this video. It's not for you. But if you are a guy and you want to be a real man, keep watching these videos because you need to avoid all these things that will be listed in these videos. Because if you are doing any of them, you are kind of feminine. First thing that makes any guy look feminine is is mannerism. How you talk and how you carry yourself as a man. As a man, you're not supposed to be doing hand gestures. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> when we're doing it, it's corny. Like, why? So your mannerism and the way you, you talk and the way you, you demonstrate if it's feminine, trust me, it's not good for you as a man. So you need to stop it. If you actually want to be regarded as a masculine man, as a man that is really a man and not just a guy that likes to be on stage. Now, another thing you need to avoid if you want to be regarded as a masculine man is for you to stop wearing makeup. Yeah, I said it. If you are a guy that you are very conscious of your appearance, you always want to fix makeup and eyelashes and all those stuff, you are not a masculine man. So if you want to be regarded as a masculine man, you need to stop wearing makeup or doing such things like that. Now, the next thing I've noticed that so many guys are doing that is actually feminine, but they don't know, is when men begin to cortex their nails. Yeah. Some of you, you paint your nails colored, not just the white and transparent ones. Like actually color your nails. That is feminine in nature. So if you are a guy and you are doing that, trust me, you are feminine. I don't, I don't care to I don't care to know whether it's trending or whatever. As long as you can take a cortex. <laughs> cortex your nails my G you are feminine in nature so in order for it to be regarded as a masculine man please do not cortex your nails now this one is is very very important and I will actually demonstrate it to you and it's the way you sit down there are some of you that cross your legs when you sit down if you are sitting like this that's feminine in nature as a man you need to spread you need to occupy space and Take charge of the, the place and the area where you are staying. This shows dominance. This shows that you are a man. So don't, don't try to tighten up yourself when you are in a public place. And don't try to invade people's space too. But do it with caution. But make sure when you sit, you spread yourself out because you are a man and you are not trying to make yourself small. So that is it. When next you sit in public, make sure the man spread like this. Thing that makes you look feminine as a man is when you are working like a woman. If your working step is like that of a lady, it portrays feminine look concerning you as a man. So if you want to be a masculine man, please you need to learn to walk like a man. Chest out, shoulders back, head straight, and you walk like somebody that is about to conquer a nation and like somebody that has value and has worth. And stop swaying and catwalking like a sissy. So please, all these things I've listed, make sure you avoid it because every single one of them makes you look like a woman. It looks feminine and it's not good if you want to be regarded as a masculine man. And finally is the outfit you put on. There are some outfits that just screams feminine. And if you are that kind of guy that is, that is always wanting to wear blouse, and you want to wear skirt, you want to put on heels. <laughs> My G. I'm not going to call any name though, but we all know that there's a popular Nigerian celebrity that okay, two actually, that actually do them stuff. So I don't want to call any name. But if you are like that kind of guy, my G, please you need to stop it and you need to carry yourself with respect. You need to dress well like a man should dress and carry yourself with dignity. So that's it for me, gentlemen. I hope I've not offended anybody. If I've offended you, then you're not really supposed to be watching this video in the first place. So these videos are for those that actually want to be seen as masculine men. And 
please make sure you avoid all these things and don't do them because it's, it's not, it doesn't look good on you, my G. So that's it. Do well to share this video with somebody that would be able to learn from all these things I've talked about. And feel free to like, comment, and share this video. And until next time, always remember, you are the price. Oh,